chestnut roasting. Jack Frost nipping at your nose. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm actually house sitting and I asked you guys on my spam account if you would be interested in me doing like a house sitting vlog because I'm gonna be house sitting for a couple of days. I'm house sitting from the 16th through the 20th at my grandparents' house. They just went out of town for a little bit and they wanted me to watch their dogs. So I'll show you guys their animals so you can see. So their first baby is right here. Her name is Emery. She is a Pomeranian. I believe she's a miniature Pomeranian or Tika Pomeranian. I have no clue, but she's a big girl. She's overweight, so yeah, she's kind of big. And then this is Mickey. He is their little boy. You can literally barely see his eyes. He's so dark, but he's so, so tiny. So yeah, these are the two puppies and I'm gonna be watching them for a little bit. Usually when I house it, I just honestly spend my day sitting on the couch, watching TV, editing. But since I'm gonna be filming, I don't wanna just be sitting here. So I'm gonna try to do some stuff. Friday, I actually have to take my laptop to the Apple store to get fixed because a really long time ago, my friend accidentally like chipped the bottom glass in my laptop and I just haven't got it fixed ever since. So I've literally just been using it like that. And some of the keys in the keyboard are kind of getting stiff so I kind of need to get all of that fixed. So I'm going to go take it. And if they can do it the same day, then I'll leave it. But if not, then I'm going to have to wait till after Vlogmas. But yeah, usually when I house it, this is kind of what they leave for me. So she usually always writes me a little note. Then they give me the money that they're paying me to do it. And also she just left this little frame because she just had an extra one. She said like whoever wanted it. And then on the 17th, it's Emery's birthday. So this is her little birthday gift. And then also my dad's birthday is on, I believe the 19th. I, that sounds so bad. But this is what they got him for his birthday. And they just got him a little happy birthday balloon. It's really hard to remember because it's like Emery's birthday Then my grandma and her twin sister have a birthday That's like the day before my dad's or the day after my dad's It's the 18th and the 19th so I get their birthdays mixed up But yeah, I just got to their house like maybe 10-15 minutes ago I left them out to potty It's like 3.50 in the afternoon And I'm about to watch The Bachelorette It airs on Tuesdays but I usually watch it on Wednesdays Because I watch it on Hulu I watch it like the recorded version of it And then also Julia and Maddie are going to be coming over And we're going to be filming a Who Knows Me Better video So I bought these two little whiteboards so they could have have that and like write their answers and stuff so I'm really excited for that but yeah right now we're just gonna chill I'm gonna watch The Bachelorette and I'll see you guys whenever we do something interesting I'm about to watch the men tell all and then after I'm watching the 11th episode I believe this is 10 and then it's 11 I'm making a Salisbury steak microwavable right now I love Salisbury steak it's so good comment down below who your favorite guy on The Bachelorette is right now I love Brendan I love Riley I love Ivan easy was literally like one of my top favorites Riley was my favorite but then I started to really like easy and then she sent him home and I was like girl what who else do I like oh I like Ben Ben's Ben's working on me but let me know down below who your favorite one of the guys are because I'm very curious I used to never watch this but then I started watching the bachelor last season and I really started to like it but I started watching it like really far into the end of it and I've been watching the bachelor like since the beginning and I am obsessed like I am so invested into it now I 100% understand the hype of like watching this show cuz it's actually really good it's really good I loved Riley. Yeah. Oh my god, she's sending home like all the wrong people. Okay, I just want to update y'all. I'm on the part where she's sending home Riley and I'm literally like, my heart is just torn out. This is my live reaction to her last rose before hometown. Brendan. <gasps> yes! I love Brennan. Okay, I like these last three. Mm -hmm. She has Zach, Ivan, and Brennan. The only one I'm kind of sad about is Ben, but Noah and Bennett can go. I didn't really so, like Noah for a long time so there, but he started so growing on me whenever the whole Bennett and Noah situation happened. I oh, Ben got a rose. How did I miss that? Okay, well, never mind. Very never mind. It's Ben, Brennan, Ivan, and Zach. Y'all, I'm full on ugly crying over Riley and Tasha. Like, why am I crying? Y'all see this? It's like real tears. Real tears? <laughs> Okay, I just finished Mintel All and oh my god, I literally cried like a baby that whole episode. I have never cried about The Bachelorette ever before like in any of the episodes that I've watched so far. But I don't know, that was like, that was sad. That was just so sad. I probably look like an idiot. I really probably look dumb. But I don't know, if you watch The Bachelorette, you probably, you probably know a little bit where I'm coming from. But I just was so sad about it. It was kind of really sad. I don't know. But now I'm about to watch episode 11, so wish me freaking luck. It's 6.30 now, and I'm letting the doggies go potty. Come on, Mickey, Emery, let's go. He literally was barking like he needed to go potty. And now, look at him. Look at him. Come on, you little goofball. I have to use a flashlight, though, because Mickey's really dark, and you can't really see him when he goes around. Look at all their little Christmas decorations. I think it's kind of crazy how, like, other places, it's, like, 20 degrees, and people are like, oh, my God, it's warm. And I'm like, what? Like, what? No. Good boy, Mickey. Go potty. Go potty, Emery. Good girl, Emery. Look. 
look you guys Mickey literally will go and like pee like right on top of where she goes look watch <laughs> look there he went <laughs> I think my sister should be coming over in a little bit she said she wants to use my grandparents air fryers so who knows I'm gonna call her in a second and see when she's coming I actually haven't watched episode 11 yet because this thing about Johnny Depp and Amber popped up and I've been watching what's going on with them and I'm just like I don't know it's just very different right now I'm actually watching someone kind of pick apart all the body language that was in their like court and stuff so I'm listening to that and they're basically just like picking out okay this body language meant that this and this and this and this and yeah it's just really Really, really shocking and I heard that the Warner Brothers actually like took Johnny Depp off and he's not gonna be in this movie that's come that was supposed to come out I think it's just really shocking like it's really crazy so yeah that's kind of what I've been watching and then after I get done watching that I'm going to actually watch the rest of The Bachelorette so I'm watching that right now and then I'm gonna watch The Bachelorette so it's like 10 o'clock at night and my sister is gonna come over here in just a little bit and we're gonna go run to Walmart really quick and she's gonna get some stuff to make kale chips. I don't know what's going on in her mind, but she, she doesn't even like kale, so I don't even know why she's trying to make them. But anyway, she's gonna try to make kale chips and I'm gonna go with her and then she's gonna come back here because my grandparents have the air fryer that she's gonna need to use. But right now I'm actually in the process of looking at tattoo ideas because I really wanna finish up my arm sleeve. Basically, I want to do a sleeve right here. I haven't decided if I wanna do an entire arm sleeve, but I know for right now, I do want to just finish up this bottom part of my arm. Trust me when I say this, I love my arms, but I just don't know what else to put on it. Like, I love this arm and what I have going for it, but I don't know what else to do. And it's honestly just because the placement's, like, really weird. Like, what do I put here? Like, what do I put in this filler space, you know? And then, like, what do I put back here? So, I'm just really lost, and I've been looking on Pinterest, and so far, I really cannot find anything. Like, I even took pictures of my arm and took, like, little PNGs. I don't know if you can see, but, like I took like little PNGs and I've been playing around with it and trying to put stuff on my arm See if I like it and I just literally can't find anything that I like So I reached out to this girl to hopefully like draw me something But I told her straightforward I was like I just don't want you to put this time and effort into drawing it But then I end up not getting it So like make sure you're okay with the possibility of me not actually getting it So I just thought I would reach out and ask anybody else You know if you can draw or you're really good at drawing tattoos Reach out to me on DM and I will literally personally send you pictures on my arm so that you you can draw me up something. The reason I want to send pictures of my arm because I want it to be able to like match my arm and like fit on my arm. So hopefully I want to like send a full on picture of my arm and that way you can like maybe draw directly onto my arm. I don't know if that's how it works. Or you could like draw the tattoos that I already have on like paper and then fill in the space I guess. But if you're really good at drawing or you know someone who is, please tell them to reach out to me on DM. My Instagram is always down below but I'll pop it up on the screen right here. I really want to finish my arm and I want to move on to my other arm but I just feel like I can't get any other tattoo until I finish this arm so if you know anyone I can draw please DM me but yeah that's my little spill for the night and then I might film when my sister gets here and we're making kale chips I don't know hey guys good morning it's now like 1 10 you can hear my nephew in the background but my sister and my nephew stayed the night last night they're gonna have to leave in just a little bit because he only has like I think two more diapers left I just brushed my teeth and got ready kind of I'm gonna have to go home anyways there's Sadie my sister's dog we already let the dogs out and stuff last night so she's not up to par Sadie are you playing with their toy so it's almost four o'clock and I'm just sitting outside with the dogs letting them go to the bathroom here's Mickey Sadie's right there but yeah I pretty much just been editing all day right now I'm editing my productive day in the life and as I'm filming this video I'm gonna edit it just so I can have it ready to go up when it needs to go up I'm kind of crunching together all of my editing and my filming just for these last few days of vlogmas just because I'm kind of filming them all back to back and then having to edit them and just yeah so right now I'm not really focused on my school which is kind of bad but I've just been procrastinating it so I'm gonna try to just get the rest of this vlogmas out of the way so I don't have vlogmas to like procrastinate with anymore because that's really kind of what I've been doing I've just been oh I need to edit so I'm gonna edit instead of doing my homework and things like that which is not really good but it's fine we just have a few more days of vlogmas and then I'll have like two straight weeks to just focus on school and hone in on that this video is gonna be so long because I'm literally just like ranting the whole entire time but today I ordered two perfumes I ordered black opium in cloud by Ariana Grande so I did curbside pickup for that and my mom is going to get that and then I'm gonna go home and pick that up and I also ordered a few things off of Amazon 
yeah, that's pretty much my update for right now. I'm just letting the dogs use the bathroom and then I'm gonna go inside and continue to edit. And then I might film whenever I get home and like show you my perfumes and stuff that I ordered and I'm really excited for them. <laughs> I just got back to my grandparents' house. It's like 8.30 right now. And I just wanted to show you guys that I got my LED lights. And also, like I showed you guys, I ordered this little fuzzy thing because my steering wheel gets super cold in the wintertime. So this is gonna be really nice for just driving because sometimes it's like just so bad that it's like hard to even like put my hands on the steering wheel. So this is gonna help. And then in the summertime, it'll be just really easy to just take it off really quick and then put it back on, you know, when the winter comes and stuff. But I'm really excited about my lights. So I'll just show you guys kind of what they look like. I will link in the description if I remember which ones I actually got but they just look like this I haven't actually put them in yet like I have them in the floor but they're eventually gonna go like that so they'll kind of look like that but right now I just kind of have them floating but basically it plugs in right here and it goes like that you just turn it on and off and here's the remote that changes the colors and then also a really cool feature is there's an app and that also changes the colors so that's so nice and yeah I'm just really excited about them I think they're really cool and I think just at nighttime when I'm with my friends and stuff it'll be really nice to just drive around and have the lights playing but yeah it's like 8 30 now i'm just back at my grandparents so i'm gonna let the dogs out i'm gonna just edit and i will see you guys tomorrow i'm pretty much not gonna do anything fun and if i do i'll vlog for you but besides that i'm just gonna edit and get it out of the way because tomorrow i'm actually taking my laptop to the apple store and if they end up being able to fix it i'm gonna have to leave it there so i'm gonna be even more behind on like videos so i'm gonna have to get what i have edited edited now so that they're able to take my laptop and fix it really quick and hopefully i'll get it back either the same day or the very next day but who knows Currently like 9.30 in the morning and my sister just dropped off my little nephew. You're so smiley. You're happy. He's a happy boy. Hopefully it's in focus. If not, I'm sorry. But he has a stinky diaper, so we're gonna change it really quick. I'm just watching him for like an hour while he goes and runs some few errands that she really needs to get done. And you're just happy. Yes, you are. He's so smiley. He loves getting his diaper changed. I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you do. Let's see what you did. See what you left me. <laughs> okay. Oh, just a BB. Yeah, that wasn't bad at all. That wasn't bad at all. Yeah, you love getting your diaper changed. Yes, you do. Yeah. Okay, let's step to Bobo. Yeah, we gotta make sure we clean the Bobo walk too. You're so silly. Gotta dry. We don't want it to stay wet, right? We don't want it to stay wet. I really need to edit this video and like everything I have so far, but I'm kind of scared that I'll take it to the Apple store and literally like something will happen and like all my footage will be gone. So I don't know if I'm going to yet or not. I kind of need to decide that within the next couple like hours because my appointment to take my laptop is at like three something and I need to know before then. You look so handsome in your camo outfit. It. Yeah, you do. Are you the happiest baby in the world? Are you the happiest boy in the world? I missed a button. I gotta start over. Okay, time for your britches. Okay, now it's time for your socks. Look how cute his little socks are today. I'm really so excited to get to babysit him. I can't wait. I feel like it's gonna be really good for me just to like learn and grow as like a future mom because obviously I'm gonna have kids. And it'll be a good time period where like I really will like have to take take it super seriously it's not gonna be just like watching a baby for an hour it's gonna be like literally full time watching him and it's gonna be really like good for me to do that and have that experience it's just been really nice for me to be able to watch him and experience everything right with my sister yeah it's been fun right it's been fun it's been fun okay so right now we're waiting on my mom to come back to the car we're at the I'm apple store shut my door oh Basically, we went to the Apple store and they said they couldn't fix my laptop for like seven to ten days, so we got it back now. And I'm taking it home, and then they're gonna order the parts, and then we'll come back and I'll get it fixed after that. So that's the plan right now, and we're gonna go get some stuff for tomorrow. We're gonna go home, and then Julia and Maddie are gonna come over, and we're gonna film after that. Okay, so it's like 9.20 and Maddie and Julia are both here. We just filmed a Who Knows Me Better video. But yeah, we're just gonna have a girls night. So I'll probably, I might film a little bit of us hanging out, but probably not because we all need this girls night. We all have had eventful week. <laughs> so I think we're just gonna have a girls night and I'll probably just see you guys in the morning, but who knows where the night will take us.
It's now like the 21st of December and it's like 5.30 and I just went to the post office and picked up a few of my packages. And basically my grandparents ended up coming home on Saturday instead of Sunday. So I got to go ahead and leave and I didn't have to stay the extra night. But on Saturday we actually had to go to this family little thing that we were doing. So I didn't end up filming the rest of that day. So I just thought I would add this little part to it because I want to open this stuff. So I'm not like waiting until like whenever I start filming again to do it. First we're going to start off with our two letters. So this one is from a girl named Sarah. So this is just what her little letter looks like it's just a really cute little Christmas card thank you so much for the sweet letter Sarah and also a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year to you as well this one I don't know the name on it so I'm just gonna go ahead and open it and see if I can like read the name from the inside of the letter so it's just this really cute little Christmas card oh I'm so sorry that your mom passed away I think the name is Erin thank you so much for the sweet letter I'm so sorry about your mom but I hope you have a Merry Christmas and also a Happy New Year the next thing is just this really small package and I kind of opened this up in the car because my mom had pointed out that it's not like sealed so first just comes with a cute little card and it says findings of comfort and joy i don't know if y'all can read that but it's just what's the deal pickle and that's her page so i actually think i remember customizing this a little bit so someone asked me for the initial of my nephew and i sent it to her and i'm pretty sure it was this so this is the first little ornament it just has a little blue e for my nephew so cute i showed my sister that in the car this is so cute this one says stink stank stunk that's so funny oh this one's funny i should give this one to my grandpa this one says Merry Christmas we survived 2020 with a mask that is so so cute what the heck oh, oh my god okay this one I'm definitely gonna put in my room this one just says that way it has a butterfly on it so cute I'm obsessed with butterflies and then she made one for cam it's just like little um gravel letters that's so cute oh and then there's another one for me and it just says Savoy on it I love this this is so cute thank you so much you guys should definitely go shop I'm pretty sure it's an Etsy but I'm not sure but just look that up on Etsy or look that up on Instagram I don't know and you should definitely go look at some of her ornaments this is so cute thank you so much but anyways the next box that i have is from gatehouse supplies so it's like a fedex thing i'm kind of nervous there are marshmallows in this that's um kind of weird oh wait i think i might know what this is if this is what i think it is the marshmallows make sense if not then that's kind of random oh my god i'm so excited okay so this girl actually reached out to me and she told me that because i was talking about making hot cocoa bombs but that it was really hard and this girl reached out to me and she was like oh my god yeah like making hot cocoa bombs is really hard but my mom actually has a business and she makes them and she told me that she would send me a few and i'm so excited i think that's what they are yes that is what it is but they broke so the page is miss v's pop and boutique but it also comes with a little card and it tells you how to make them i asked for french vanilla s'more salted caramel grinch peppermint lucky charms so this one is the french vanilla cappuccino it just looks like this so cute i'm so sad that some of them broke but i'm so excited for this one this one's so good i'm only going to show you guys the ones that didn't break because i feel like that's just kind of like what's the point in showing you guys the one that did break you know and then this one is obviously the grinch one it's just green super cute and then i think this one is the s'mores one it did have marshmallows on it but i didn't realize that they were part of it so i kind of plucked them off but i'm pretty sure this is the s'mores one and yeah this is just her card this is what she made i will actually pop up a picture of all of her hot chocolate bomb flavors and stuff just because i kind of feel bad that they broke because that was definitely 100 not her fault that was completely just the handling part of the shipping and handling so i don't blame her at all but i will definitely have this picture of what her hot chocolate bombs usually look like because i don't want you guys to think that they don't look good because they really do look good and i'm super excited to try them out so thank you so much for sending me these but yeah i hope you guys liked today's video if you did give it a thumbs up don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below and don't forget to turn on your post notifications to be notified whenever i post and i will see you guys in my next one bye although it's been said many times many ways merry christmas